Greetings, Keechlings. Keech Prime here with my live reaction of Record of Ragnarok or Shimatsu no Valkyrie, Chapter 82. Alright, Apollo got knocked down. Let's see where things go from here. No, it can't be. I'm going to zoom out slightly. There we go. No, it can't be true. There's no way, Master Apollo. He looks like that. Yeah, he got hit hard. Know thyself. Oh, he's going to come back in this one. Leonidas strikes with a wonderful counterattack. He's just over there puffing. The indomitable king of Sparta at last has struck down the god of sun. Knocked down to the ground. Awesome. He turned the tables with a single blow. So that's the mighty king of Sparta. Sparta, Sparta, Sparta. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. He'll be getting into it. Uh, he really smashed Master Apollo squarely in the face. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Even with a strike like that, he just wouldn't go down. So, we're still with Jack watching it on that little TV. Tremendous mental strength and a strong body. The Spartans are truly a fearsome people. <laughs> She's like, <"Meh." laughs> Sparta is not the only one. Oh, wow. Whoops. <laughs> what? <laughs> what is she barking about? Like Who do you think he's fighting with? When she's angry, she's the scariest of the 13 sisters. Gerulu. I don't know how to pronounce her name. My big sis. <laughs> the image of my sister breaks down. Breaking down and getting angry. It was the first time I ever saw it. That is a good sign that we can trust her. <laughs> <laughs> no, excuse me. Yes, indeed. You can do your best, uh, Garula. I don't know how to pronounce that. I swear to God. <laughs> no, Lord. Tuh. Hell yeah. So she's actually like appearing beside him oh is our level now narcissistic god i think we have a winner here don't we oh he's struggling to get up no the god of the sun hasn't burnt up <sighs> yeah i wish i could burn out my allergies good lord so he's struggling to get back up Ooh, that big gash on his forehead i forgot our across his face not even as far as there's no way the most beautiful god of all the heavens can be seen like this he's in shambles <sighs> I can barely get through a page master Apollo no you can't watch anymore don't stand in front of Sparta go back to sleep we don't want to look ungrateful or graceful to you do you ungraceful you say Sorry. But the sneezing just won't stop. You won't understand, or you wouldn't understand, would you? I'm just starting to burn my soul to beat you. This version of me right now is the most beautiful. Oh, are we about to... Uh, I can feel it already. Either my nose is running, or I'm sneezing. And I feel disgusting on camera. Bah. Beautiful, huh? He's just being stubborn. They ripped him to shreds like that, so there's nothing left to say. <laughs> hmm. So not even the gods are on his side right now. You know, we're just gonna hit each other square in the face like idiots after all. That's how it ends. Your body's condition is important, you know that, right? Jeez, those outsiders are so... being so selfish. Hmm. After all, you care about Apollo, don't you? There's no way. What? It's just, there's no way he's forgotten where he stands. Mm -hmm. Oop, that one's empty. Mm -hmm. Lord, I'm just being a mess here on video today. Oh, that one's even tight. No wonder. <laughs> it became a dribble glass. That's right. I know nothing else, but Apollo is the only one. 
to know himself better than any other god. I don't even know how to pronounce that. Know thyself. Ah. <coughs> These are the words inscribed on the temple of Delphi, which honors the god Apollo. The ancient Greeks are said to have understood it this way. You lowly humans acknowledge your own position, all right. God of philosophy, god of poetry, god of medicine, god of the bow, god of music, god of philosophy. I'm pretty sure if anyone was going to be god of, excuse me, of, uh, of the bow, it would be his sister. And all from the powerful god Apollo, revered as the god of the sun. A reminder to all foolish men. But was that truly the divine will of Apollo? No, 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 no. It's the opposite. It's quite the opposite. There are true stories to back it up. In ancient Greece, when humans and gods still live close to one another, in the land of Delphi, there was a monster named Python. The village of Delphi. It's just a village. Ooh, he is quite monstrous. Are you afraid of me? Run! Be more scared. Be more frightened. He was chased from heaven because of his bizarre appearance. Really? Every so often, he would raid human villages. Ah, it's one of those bastards. <clears throat> That's enough of you monsters. Or, monster. We've been ordered by Master Ares to eliminate Ares' divine divisions. Okay. He just kicked their asses. <laughs> hooray, hooray. You look a lot like bluffing gods. And he returned fire on all the gods who came to avenge them. Dang. He was out of control, running berserk. Oh no, I'm so scared. So there's people hiding? Hmm. He was hated as the snakes. Until one day. Ah. There is a... is that his... I'm not sure what this is. Oh, that's what he looks like underneath. Okay, I thought that was part of his body. <clears throat> you have destroyed my friend god Ares' army, Python, right? Who are you? <laughs> you, you, one god descended and... To live up to the expectations of my god friend, I will take care of thou. <laughs> Heaven. What? Apollo gone? Why? He said that Lord Ares had expectations of him. That making decisions on his own again, the sun rises without being asked. A friend's expectations are always met. Even when they're not asked for. I don't understand what you want to say. Hmm. But to have Apollo, one of the twelve gods of Olympus, come all the way here? This is perfect. I don't like the look on your stupid face. I will rip you to pieces. Okay. <laughs> Apollo just... One punch! He defeated Python with one strike. <laughs> I defeated you. Seems like I won. Uh, this damn god... Uh, I will kill you. And he goes again. I just got striked with one hit. But I was... What was that force? However... Hmm, I won't be defeated by someone like you. I... I... I haven't lost yet! Kind of weird how he looks almost completely different when he's got the... The little outfit on. Well then, we shall continue tomorrow. What? I will stay in this comfortable bed. You go find somewhere else to sleep. Ah, uh, he just stole his bed. And then, and then, my nose started running in. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. So they continued to fight day after day, it looks like. The next day, and the day after that, just getting one shot. Day after day, Python challenged Apollo and was defeated. Until one day, what, did he just finally die? No, he gave up, it looks like. Shit. Damn you, damn you, damn you. I, I can't keep losing. I won't lose again against someone like you. Why do you keep pushing yourself? 
the hideous this hideous appearance what's so beautiful to look like this I mean you look like the lizard from Marvel appearance I don't care about that your beauty is what you are now you fight against yourself and fight with your burning soul that's beautiful you, you don't know anything I know because I myself I'm equal to you was Apollo an almighty brilliant god all along no Apollo was well known amongst the Greek gods as an ordinary god however <clears throat> well I mean he was only half human or only half a god so he's a demigod god of philosophy of poetry of medicine of the bow of philosophy and boxing Apollo wasn't born with all these abilities he acquired them with blood and effort so it's showing him doing all these things <coughs> interesting The ordinary god who had nothing became one of the twelve gods of, of Olympus. With time, he even was praised like the god of the sun. Like, he just became. <laughs> uh, the god of the sun. The shining Apollo. And of course, he didn't have anything covering his crotch on that statue. You and me equals... Those without beauty are forced in the precinct and what uh, that's present well <laughs> I can't read now uh, it's all falling apart and won't move forward the ones who rest on their laurels on their current happiness on their current fortune aren't beautiful the ones who know themselves and what they lack the ones who know themselves and know they're weak the ones who know themselves and are not afraid of change. The ones who truly know themselves, know and trust their own beauty. So basically this is all like, become more than your current self. The effort in which you put into it is what makes you beautiful to change. And his brilliance is just shining upon, but I'm a lowly beast hurting people. Well, whose fault was that? A snake who stepped on its tail can bite a man. I suppose I would also go on a rampage to protect my own life. But we have to stop everything before it turns into a war. That's the work of the gods. I've had enough of my vacation. I'm heading home. Thanks for the bed. I, I, I'm not going to lose. I'm not going to lose ever again. All right. That's beauty. <laughs> God, this fucking face. With the... Uh. Wait, who's this? Is that the boy from earlier? Since that time, Python stopped raiding humanity. On the remains of the land of Delphi, he built a temple in Apollo's name and became its protector. Oh. Okay. And upon that temple, the words were inscribed. Know thyself from the legend of the Delphi. It is only when you know yourself that you can surpass yourself, which is why we were able to continuously improve upon himself. Zeus knows it. That is why Apollo is strong. Just more now than yesterday, and this moment more than the one before. In order to become even more beautiful, I will burn my soul. <laughs> and now you're trying to act cool. Damn, that's disgusting. God damn, I like it. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking kill you. I'm going to kill you with everything I've got. Yeah, just ruin that cigar. King Leonidas of Sparta. I don't like your foul language. However, that attack just now was beautiful. I left him in a stupor there. It seems you too are one who knows himself and whose soul is ablaze and there's only one thing to do. Together, to our heart's content, let's burn our souls to the ground. Alright, so I'm guessing next chapter is going to be the end of this fight. <coughs> We've seen 
backgrounds of both characters. We've seen them interact in the ring. We've seen them fight in the ring. So I'm assuming, yeah, we're probably at the point where, yeah, things are going to start wrapping up. <clears throat> to know thyself. To become more than you were the moment the day before. The effort is all that matters at the end of the day, which makes you true beauty. Anyway, but yeah. A simple message. I like it. <clears throat> There was no action other than the flashback, but could you even call that really action when it, he, the dude would, kept getting freaking one-shotted? So, yeah. But I did like how he was the one that created the temple and where the, the phrase, Know Thyself, from Delphi came from. <clears throat> so, yeah. Nice. But, uh, I don't really have much to say about this chapter. Um... The, the gods were waning in their support of Apollo, given, you know, the beauty that he's always shown them, and then, boom, he's in such a disgraceful, you know, strait. But, it's like, that was not the point. <laughs> um, but, yeah. Uh, let me know your own thoughts and opinions. Anything I missed, misunderstood, please let me know down below. Check out my other content, see what you like, suggest things for the future. Links down below for all my social media so you can keep up with my content and always contact me. I stream on YouTube where I do long form reactions and gaming and who knows what else. Um, <clears throat> uh, part of the One Punch Man podcast on Grim Reaper's channel, so go check that out. And as always, later days. And until next time, Keeshlings, let your soul burn with effort to change what you were today into beyond.